morning, everybody. <laughs> Good morning. As you can tell, we got a little bit of sun. A little bit of sun. Eric looks like a tomato today. It's <laughs> painful. <laughs> we spent the afternoon in the river and we got a little bit carried away with the sun. And the beers. Well, me with the beers. <laughs> I wasn't even feeling the sun. I was just enjoying life. It's not till after you get out of the water that you realize that you effed up and you should have worn sunblock. <laughs> and then after that, we did the elotes, right? Quick recap, elotes. And then after that, it was just a blur, so I don't remember. We, we didn't record much. We went to have tacos. We went to sleep early. We went to sleep early. Yeah. So this is our last full day here in Manzanillo. We come, we go back tomorrow in the afternoon. We're about to figure out our COVID testing. Yep, we have to schedule so we that. We have to schedule our appointments right now and get that done so we can enjoy the rest of the day and see what the last day or the last night of Manzanillo has in store for us. Yes. So yeah. So we just took our COVID tests and it was uncomfortable. It was my first time taking a COVID test. I'm gonna turn off the fan really quick just so I can show you guys what we just did. Here. Here. Waiting for our results. Hours remaining or 15 minutes remaining. Hopefully negative results. And here's Kristen's. <laughs> Here it is. Oh yeah, this video is not sponsored by Illum COVID-19 <laughs> home test. <laughs> but it's the easiest way for us that we thought we could get away with getting our results in time before our flights. Because otherwise we'd have to go to a pharmacy or l drive around and look for uh, rapid testing here. So our airline, Alaska Airlines, uh, sent us the links, told us the tests we need and what we need to do. It was a bit of a hassle to try to um, log everything in, our information, set up our profiles, two different apps simultaneously. You have to schedule your COVID test with a proctor online. So they need to see you on camera for an international flight. And then you have to do the swabbing and so but uncomfortable. People are nice. It's They're a nice. Center. Yeah, it's a call center setup or whatever. So that's pretty cool <laughs> to work in a place like that. And we're just waiting for our results. Exciting times, man. Exciting times. <laughs> it's gonna be- I mean, I don't have nothing like, to worry about. Neither am I. Know. I'm not worried. I'm not worried. Someone's a little nervous. Seven, six. Five, four, three, two, one. Oh, thank you, Jesus. <laughs> oh, thank you. Yeah. Yours is negative. It's negative. 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 Woo! High five. High five. Woo! Oh, high five. <laughs> thank you, Jesus. Thank you. So behind these buildings is like the ocean. Aquí las brisas es donde se inunda también. No. Aquí no. So Eric's aunt brought us to this location.
I think this is the closest I've been to the beach since we got here. This is nice. And we got to see it at sunset. So this is like a little chill spot. You can see there's a lot of families here. Um, they have like little puestecitos where they sell like uh, aguachiles, they sell like pineapple, coconut, fresh coconut. And you see people are just like lounging around. They have like a little play area for the kids over here. And yeah, you can see the port over here with all the uh, storage bins that come in. Pretty cool. This is so nice, look at this. <laughs> Why? Hmm? Why? Because I look like a badass. Look at that. Hi, right, Chris. This is being recorded. Do you know that? I don't care. People can know I'm a badass. <laughs> Love your body. <laughs> so what's that? These little stars? What are they for? Is this decoration? No, so this is to help to protect the, it's like a barrier against the waves. When when the tides are high, like storms and stuff, mm -hmm. these things um, protect. protect it so that this doesn't okay. get ruined. So you're telling me that, yes, oh, we were in the Sentinel, is over there? Yeah. That's crazy. Across from that. That's so crazy. But the waves get a, as high as these things and they come over it and they, this is like the second time they build it. Really? Mm hmm So this is the end of the, you can say like boardwalk. Pretty cool. There's like the sun in the background. The ocean. The center over there. Pretty cool, pretty nice. Relaxing, enjoying the sound of the waves. Waiting for the sunset. This is our last night in Manzanillo. Yes. This is our last sunset in the port. And the rain. The rain is gone. <laughs> I knew we were leaving, so it's like, let's That's give beautiful. these guys a break. But then you look over there and it's like <laughs> raining it. Uh oh. We're taking it all in before we go back to our routine. Mm-hmm. Our lovely California routine <laughs> but i'm not complaining i'm ready to go back to my little to my babies there's chris here am i this is probably where we say goodbye yeah probably not if but close more, if we do anything else we'll um we'll include it <laughs> we'll try to show it but <laughs> no, i need to get down here all right. No, si son bravos. La otra vez que estábamos allá regando en la casa, salió uno bien grande, grande. 
Estábamos los tres. Estábamos yo y yo también. No, estábamos allá afuera. The colors, I don't know if you guys can see it on camera, but these colors. Last day in Manzanillo, we came back to the centro because Cristito wanted to get some sandals. And so we're going back to the car and we're gonna be heading out to the airport in a couple hours. So I'm gonna go spend time with family and just say goodbye and we'll be on our way. What are you eating? Tacos. Tacos. De cabeza. Sí. Provechón. <laughs>